Since I grew up in Africa, the only page I ever saw was the one in books. And there was a book in particular called The Wind in the Willows by Graham Robertson. It told the unlikely story of three animals, Mole, Ratty and Badger. And even back in 1908, where this book was first written, uh, Badgers and the stories associated with, with Badgers was worth telling. It was something that captured the imagination of all the children. And fast forward all these years and not only have I seen Badgers, but I've been shooting badges. So before I get up there, Pages is just here. Um, let me first tell you a little bit about Pages. So, first of all, stay till the end because at the end I'm going to show you some really cool footage uh, that I managed to capture of some Pages and uh, <laughs> they're really cute and it'll be fun to see. So, stay until the end. Um, so, where do I start with Pages? So, Pages uh, are persecuted in the UK, let's put it that way. And this is done under license from the UK government. Ever since 2013, uh, the UK government has been giving license to, to cull badges. Uh, uh, 210, 210,000 badges have been killed in that time. So that is 21, I was just doing the maths, that is 21,000 badges every year. And this is a protected species, so I'm not sure why it's protected. Uh, when 210,000 get killed every year, but it's a protected species. Is this illegal for you to go and mess with the badger set, mess with badgers, to disturb, to destroy, to, to, to damage a, a badger set, right? Or a badger? A little bit of... A little bit... Un, I don't really understand it. Let's just call it that. So, it's a protected animal, yet you can hunt it. Makes no sense. Anyway. Here's a couple of things that you can do to protect badgers and protect them the way we want to protect them, right? Everybody loves dogs and everybody loves taking their dogs for a walk. So keep your dog on a lead. Uh, make sure it doesn't go down uh, any badger holes. Uh, you know, they talk about a dog down a rabbit hole. Well, a dog down a badger hole also happens. And um, don't dig in the badger set and don't destroy the badger set. Not only is it illegal, but it's also something we don't want to do. Enjoy the badger set from a distance. Enjoy the badgers from a distance. So I photograph badgers. Uh, I put up remote cameras that do not disturb the badgers. And I, uh, in the day, I keep my distance. Or when I expect to see the badgers, I keep my distance. Um, and the other thing is, The other thing is, enjoy the experience, by all means, but don't go and call massive crowds and people together and come and see, come and see what I found, come and see what I found. Don't do that. Um, huge amounts of people is going to disturb this, the badgers, right? If it's you and your wife or you and your son and you happen to find a badger set and you see a badger, by all means, enjoy it. But just don't go and call your neighbors and everybody to come and have a look. That's not necessary. Okay, so I'm um, on my way to the badger. It's just over this hill over here. Uh, let's crack on and uh, I'll show you what the badger set looks like. This is an old badger set. There's no badgers there anymore that I know of. And I haven't seen them. I've never photographed these badgers. And uh, I've only ever seen them on some night cameras. I will show you why this is an old badger set. So let's go and have a look. So this is a badger set. I don't know why I'm whispering because like I said, this is wrong. So anyway, um, this is an old badger set and I'll show you just now why it's old. Uh, but whenever you see a badger set, and you'll know it's a badger set when you see 
in the earth there's basically three fours more uh, holes dug in and they face those holes about uh, say a dog could fit in them and um, they'll be close together so let me show you so basically uh, as you can see so these are these are holes uh, here's one here's another and here's the third one so as you can see these are together quite close and uh, badgers will do this and badgers will use burrows uh, to navigate they enter sleep and they spend most of their time in these burrows and they navigate in these tunnels and um, the reason why I say these are old let, let me show you so let me pick up a stick here just so I don't disturb and leave human imprint okay so the reason why I say these are old is, as you can see here, there's, there's loads of leaves at the entrance. Now, usually the, the entrance to a badger hole is nice and clean and or shows some signs that you can see. I'll, I'll show you off the internet. But these, as you can see, are full of leaves. So, yeah. So, now you know what a badger set looks like. You know that if you find one, uh, enjoy it. Uh, if you're going to stay out and try and see the badgers, by all means do it. Just keep your distance and uh, good luck if you do see the badgers are uh, amazing animals to see don't scare them they'll come out their eyesight is poor so they probably will not see you but they will hear you and they will smell you so be quiet and uh, be aware of where you are this always brings back all some memories and I, and I love seeing a badger and I love seeing a badger set so this is cool Hey folks, thanks for staying till the end here, and uh, like I promised, there is some interesting footage coming up. So I put out these night cameras to uh, see if there were badgers where I thought they'd be. And I saw this mom and this baby coming out on the first, uh, the, I think it was the first or the second night I had put this out. And then <laughs> the second one came out and I've never seen little baby badgers in the wild before. So my wife and I were watching this. We we're super stoked. We'd never seen uh, a baby badger before. And even though I never got to photograph these guys, uh, the, the conditions and the place just wasn't suitable. I still really enjoyed watching these videos. And this shows the little guy trying to come out. There's something that's bugging him because he's taking his time coming out there. But he will eventually come out and um, join his brother or sister. So here he comes. He's almost out there. There he comes and he immediately greeted. So this was very chuffed. And then the next day uh, or the next clip, I saw them again, mom and two babies uh, by the burrow. But then out of the out of the left corner there, you can see there's actually three. So three little buggers um, and a mom and a dad. It's really awesome to see. I'm glad you guys have stayed and enjoyed this uh, little clip uh, about badges and I hope to see you again. If you like my stuff, please subscribe, give me a like and a comment and ring that bell. I'm going to leave this here playing these uh, videos of these, little, these three little guys playing. Uh, it's really cool to see and uh, I'll just let it play it out with a bit of music. So see you again and see you next time. Cheers. Cheers.